In this video, you'll see how to enhance observability for your AWS services using Metrics Explorer. With this tool, you can filter, aggregate, and visualize operational health and performance metrics by tags and resource properties. The visualizations you create are dynamic, so widgets and dashboards stay up to date as resources are added or deleted. To get started, let's navigate to Metrics Explorer in CloudWatch. First, we'll create a Metrics Explorer widget using a generic Lambda by Runtime template. We can narrow or broaden the amount of aggregated data by using the date and time filters. We can see all the chosen metrics options and make changes if necessary. We can take further action as well, like aggregating time series based on functions such as average, min, max, and sum, and show separate graphs by splitting them based on tag values. Let's add this widget to a global dashboard in CloudWatch. We'll create a new dashboard for this widget. Now that our dashboard is saved, let's go back to Metrics Explorer. This time, let's use a service-based template. We'll select the RDS template to graph all Amazon Relational Database Service instances that support our backend services. We'll select a tag for RDS instances with a CloudFormation stack name of Services. As we create graphs and charts, we have many options available. For example, we can change the type of chart to a pie or bar chart, modify the legend location, and rearrange the page layout. We can also navigate between pages using the tab numbers next to the Add to Dashboard button. Let's create a new dashboard for these RDS metrics in CloudWatch. There is no limit on the number of CloudWatch dashboards in an AWS account. Metrics Explorer widgets are dynamic, so if we now add or remove an RDS instance that has the Services tag, this dashboard will update automatically. Next, let's aggregate metrics for all of our Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud, or Amazon EC2, instances in the US East 1A availability zone. In a matter of seconds, the widget is created. We'll add this widget to a new dashboard in CloudWatch as well. Next, let's navigate to the CloudWatch Dashboards page to see another way to set up a Metrics Explorer visualization. Here are the three dashboards we created in Explorer. When we drill into a dashboard, notice the Settings icon in the top left corner of the graphs that we can use to access the Query page and make changes. This time, we'll create the dashboard first and then add a Metrics Explorer widget to it. We can add a pre-filled widget that uses the same templates we saw earlier, or we can add an empty Explorer widget and build it from scratch. Let's create a widget that aggregates all Lambda function metrics for the latest version. The dashboard immediately populates with the widget, providing a dynamic view of the resources in this environment. You've just seen how to enhance observability for your services using Metrics Explorer. You can learn more about this topic in the description and links for this video. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.